friends welcome back to my channel I am so happy you're all here and if you're new stopping by I am so happy you're joining me as well clothing hauls and try-ons are just one of the type of video that I like to make here on my channel so I hope if you're new you'll maybe check out some of my other content and if it interests you I would love to have you subscribe and join me okay so we need to get into this video because I believe I have eight tops from Walmart to show you and of course if you see anything that you like in the video I'm gonna have them linked below for you but right now I am gonna push this camera back so I can show you this first really cute top that I got from Walmart so let's go ahead and get into this all right let me show you this first top and this is probably one of my favorite ones that I ordered from this haul now this is the no boundaries brand and I believe that is the Walmart's junior brand so I've never tried anything from no boundaries and I did size up to an extra large in this just because it is a juniors brand but I think because of the style and fit of this this is absolutely fine so let me get a little closer to show you some of the pretty details about this top all right, so you can see the really pretty pattern. It's got the blues and a little bit of purple and white, and it does have the elastic at the cuff. Up here, it's got a really pretty detail around the neckline. It has that really pretty ruffle, and then it comes into the V, and it has a tie here with the cute little fringes at the end. Now it does have buttons all the way down the front, but these buttons are not workable. And I like just the loose drapey fit. It's kind of like that boho vibe, but I also love how this looks with white denim. I think this is a great top if you're going on vacation or just through the summer. It's just so light and breezy and just a really cute top. So this is one I would definitely recommend. I'll have it linked below and I got to get moving because like I said I have a lot of tops to show you today all right this next top I'm going to show you is one of the pioneer woman tops and I have never tried her clothing line before they tend to be really colorful and usually that's not my thing but I thought this one was really cute the print and wanted to give it a try I liked the style and I do think this is a really cute one let me get a little bit closer so you can see kind of the pretty floral pattern and it does have the nice wide sleeves that are longer so this is an absolutely great top if you like to cover your upper arms but you want a little bit of airflow this would definitely be a good one it does have the v-neck and then it's got that cute tie detail at the front which i think just adds a little something extra let me show you the back so once again, I like how this looks with white denim. I think this would be cute with shorts too in the summertime. This is a really cute top. I was pleasantly surprised by this one. Okay, I have this next top on, which is this adorable free assembly pink plaid top. All right, let me get closer to show you. So this does not have a collar, but it is buttoned down all the way and I would say the length is not super long which is why I've kind of left it out I think the length of this looks cute just left out but I think this one it doesn't look sloppy out like this so I actually do like it out and I think it looks great with the white jeans let me get closer to show you the plaid it does have a tiny bit of orange with the pink and the white and then you can see here at the bottom of the sleeve it is a tie so that's something to get used to because right now I, I would have to adjust these maybe a little bit looser, but it does have the tie at the bottom of the sleeve. It's very light, feels breathable. I think this is adorable for spring. Really comfortable top and just really cute as well, I think. Okay, so this top here is from Scoop. And this is obviously a dressier top, but I thought this would look really cute with white jeans for a great outfit for going out in the summertime date night or with your friends or on vacation I thought this one would be really pretty and it really is gonna get closer so the whole top is like all the pleating if you can see so like if you pull it out you can see all the pleats but the pattern and the colors I think are just gorgeous on this one it's got the beautiful green and the blue floral 
really, really pretty. And it does have the elastic at the cuff. It's got a little bit of a notched out V. And once again, I think the length with this one, it just looks nice out. I think you could probably, you know, front tuck it if you like that look. But I kind of like the, the look of it out. I think it looks really cute. I haven't tried many items from Scoop, and I was really impressed by this one. So this is definitely a cute one, too. Okay, I have another Pioneer Woman top on, and once again, I thought the print on this one was really cute too, but this one is all about the sleeves. All right, so first let me zoom in here and show you the print. It's a pretty yellow with the pink and purple and cream. I think it is a pretty print, and it does have the V. This can kind of plunge depending on how it's falling on your shoulders. But like I said, the details with this one are on these pretty sleeves. So you can see that they are quite the bell sleeves, I think is what you call them. But it also has a pretty like ruffle detail up here. And then there's like another overlay on the sleeves, if you can see. So once again, I've got it paired with white jeans because I think that looks cute. But obviously, I think this would look really cute with regular jeans as well. Now here it is with a front tuck. Let me show you the length of this top out because this one is a little bit longer. So here is the length of this one out. But yeah, I really like this one too. Okay friends, I have a navy t-shirt to show you, but it does have some cute details. It's just a little more special than like a regular tee. So let me get up here close to show you. All right, so first of all, I hope you can see with the navy, but it has like this little bit of smocking detail. Louis decided to join us for the rest of the try on, I guess. All right, so it does have this little bit of smocking detail right up here near the shoulder. And it does have a little bit of the puff sleeve and it's like tighter fitting here on the upper arm, but not uncomfortable. It is a really nice feeling fabric. It's just very soft. And I left it out. Here is the length of this top out. Let me show you the back how long. But I think t-shirts like this are great to have because they just look a little bit more special than a regular tee. And that's what I liked about this one. So I think this is really cute. Yeah, I like this one too. All right, now I've got a sleeveless time and true top to show you. If it's looking like it's black, it's actually a navy print. So it does have the collar and it does button down the front. And the issue that I'm not sure I'm in love with this one on is that instead of just being completely sleeveless, if you can see the top of this kind of comes out a little bit over the shoulders, and I'm not sure I'm loving that. I tend to like it just, you know, sleeveless or uh, you know I'm not a fan of the cap sleeves and I don't know if I like this style either. I'm not sure what you call that. If, but it's a nice light fabric and I think the buffalo check print is really cute. I will say this is on the shorter side. I'm wearing a pair of high-waisted white jeans and you know, you could wear it with high-waisted jeans, but this is definitely not a long top. If you've got mid-rise or low-rise, you're probably going to be showing midriff with this one. So here is the front and the back. This could be a cute one for some of you. I'm just not crazy about my upper arms, and I'm not sure with the way this fits on the shoulders if it makes them look a little bit worse. All right, how sweet is this time and true white top? I think this is really pretty. Let me get a little closer so you can see some of the details. Can you see some of the, like the line, like it's got a, like a lace detail down the front and it's got this pattern in the fabric. Now, I do notice now looking at the viewfinder, this looks quite see-through. So probably I might end up wearing a cami, a nude cami under this. I mean, I do have a nude bra, but I can see now on the viewfinder that it does look quite see-through. Let me show you the sleeves here. You can see this lace detail here on the sleeve. And then it does have the elastic at the cuff. My long arms, it's not quite as long as it probably should be, but just pulling it up a little bit, I don't think it looks that bad. And then also for the neckline here, you can see it's got this little like lace detail 
up around the neck. And it also has the button with the little elastic cover to fasten at the neckline. The issue I'm wondering with this with me with fit is that I ordered a medium because usually in time and true tops I take a medium but because this is 100% cotton I'm wondering about shrinkage and if maybe I might need to size up in this one. Let me know what you think if I should size up with this one. But I think this is a really pretty top. So here it is with the front tuck and let me show you the length of this. Once again this one is not really that long either. But I think this is a really sweet top. I think you can't go wrong with a white blouse. But this has some really pretty romantic details that I just think make this one really lovely. I like this one too. Okay friends, this is the last top of the video. And if you have made it this far in, thank you so much. And if you like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It really does help my channel and I really do appreciate it. All right, so the last top I have to show you here is a free assembly. And I have never tried this style on before. I'm not really sure it's for me, but this is a really cute top. I think the pattern on this one is really pretty. It's just a very pretty floral print. Very light. It's 100% cotton and it's got like that gauzy look on the sleeves. It does have the elastic at the cuff and it's that square neckline with also the square in the back as well. The issue I'm having with this square neckline is that it's wanting to show my bra strap. Like I'm having to put my bra strap so far over on my shoulders and when you have a larger chest you really kind of need it on your shoulders to give you the support and I'm finding that just to keep my bra from not showing it's probably not the best fit for me. I, but I think this style on some women is so cute. It's got it, this elastic, maybe you'd call it ruching here underneath the bust line and then the little like is it peplum bottom so it's and it's not a real long top as you can see i mean i am wearing mid-rise jeans and there isn't a whole lot of fabric after the waistband of my jeans but i think this could be cute for some women i just think it's not quite for me just the the fit and the style but this is adorable the quality is really nice so walmart did it again so that is gonna wrap up the video today, friends. I do wanna thank you so much for joining me. If there was anything that you were interested in, I'm gonna have everything linked below in the description box, but thank you again so much for joining me. I really appreciate that you take time out of your busy days to watch my videos, I truly do. And I will see you all next time, bye.